knee ladies recovering properly. I want everyone to say that three times. Knee ladies recovering properly. Knee ladies recovering properly. Knee ladies recovering properly. So what is NLRP3? You just said it. The fact is NLRP3 is an inflammatory molecule we believe is the reason that ladies with diabetes have a three times higher chance of having a stroke and worse recovery than ladies without diabetes. So what can we do about it? Well, first we need to understand what a stroke is. Simply put, a stroke is when there's a blockage in the brain causing a disruption in blood flow. If you look at the image to the far right, uh, this is an image from my studies uh, showing all the blood vessels in the brain. The red dot symbolizes this blockage in blood flow and how it can affect a large portion of the brain. So um, in our studies, we look at brain vascular images and study their structure and shape. And we use, the, we use uh, computer software programs to analyze them. If you look at the middle image, this is a normal or healthy brain. Directly beneath that, in the diabetic state, what we have found is that there's an excess amount of blood vessels. So you would think that would be advantageous. However, these blood vessels are poorly constructed. So then when you suffer a stroke, if you look at the bottom image, we have found that they aren't able to repair themselves properly. Studies have shown that NLRP3 causes microvascular degeneration or breakdown of blood vessels uh, in the retina during the diabetic state. So while there are many factors at play, we believe that NLRP3 is being used by diabetes in a similar fashion to cause breakdown of blood vessels in the brain. In fact, our preliminary studies using uh, an NLRP3 inhibitor has shown uh, improvements in cognitive and motor deficits. We believe that there will be even greater improvements in females once we use this NLRP3 inhibitor, therefore protecting all the ladies in our lives from the devastating effects of diabetic stroke. Thank you.